Hi there and welcome to this first episode of my weekly Godot project number 8 which is Caveman Taxi, a flying taxi game. As one early part of my strategy to learn game development, I'm currently doing 9 short weekly projects making games in Godot and this is number 8. So then I got one more to do after this and then it's off to a little larger projects, the first of which will last 4 weeks. I said in my last video that I would not be making any video on this project until it's done because it's so short, but I will anyway, I changed my mind. I started a little bit on this project yesterday and to be honest I'm quite stoked about it. I'm having a real good time so I'd just like to share this. So I just ripped some graphics from images found on the internet and made some assets in Pixel Edit, which is what I use for simple graphics. And for background, this is a blatant ripoff of a 1992 game called Oog, which is abandonware, so there should be no copywriting issues here. And anyway, this is just a hobby project and not a commercial game. I think that part of the reason why I find this fun is because it looks really pretty and cute, I think. I didn't do the graphics myself, which helps, and doing graphics is not my favorite part of this, mainly because it's one of the things I don't feel I master that well, and it takes a lot of time, and usually it doesn't turn out that nice. And also, for now, I think the movement of the taxi works reasonably well. It moves a bit sluggish, which I think it should, and as more stuff will be put into the game, I'll just see how and if I need to tweak this to make it work really nice. So I'll be working today and tomorrow on this and that will be it. Uh, what I'm going for now is just to have one level and a continuous stream of customers asking to be transported somewhere. I will try to implement some of the obstacles from the original game in this one like water and the puffing dinosaur. And then it will be quite simple, just a concept prototype thing, no menus, no ending, just continuous gameplay all along. All right, so I'll leave it with this. If you enjoyed this, please hit the like button. That will be much appreciated. And also please subscribe if you want to follow me on my quest to learn game development, which I will be chasing for all of next year. So thanks for watching. Take care and I hope to see you in my next video coming up tomorrow or Wednesday.